Christmas is all about. Hey guys, what's up and welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm gonna be showing you guys my in-depth skincare routine. So one of my night skincare routines has popped off and has been getting a lot of views and a lot of questions as to how I actually cleanse my face and do my skincare routine. So I thought I'd make an in-depth video for you guys featuring my favorite skincare brand, Anua. And, oh my God, you guys, they were kind enough to send me like this whole suitcase of products plus their two bestseller cleansing products. I'm so excited to try and I thought we'd open up this package together. Now, in that recent video of mine, I did feature the Anua cleansing oil. So I'm gonna show you guys how exactly I cleanse my face. And you know those like black dots on your nose? It's from the sebum built up. So this cleansing oil actually really helps it. Let's get right into this skincare video. So in this video, we're gonna be doing the viral Korean double cleansing method which is a great way to help the clogged pores. So clogged pores occur when sebum builds up in the skin and when it cannot be discharged properly. And the clogged pores are the ones that cause pimples, so the whiteheads. This is a really interesting fact, but when the sebum penetrates the skin cell and then meets the air and oxidizes, that's what causes blackheads. And this is where double cleansing can prevent all of this from happening. Okay, so the whole theory behind double cleansing, I'm gonna get like super deep and into it because I feel like knowing this information can be very helpful. The reason why there's two products needed for double cleansing is the cleansing oil can get into the pores and melt the sebum. So it allows for it to come out easier and without a harsh extraction method. Then you go in with a cleansing foam because that's the one that can penetrate the skin even more deeply and then removes the dead skin cell in the pore. Now I'm gonna show you guys my skin. We're gonna get super up close and personal. I have all these acne scars. I have these little annoying white pimples. So I have a bit of texture here. And this is my forehead and my nose area. All right, let's go to the bathroom and try out the cleansing products because I haven't actually tried out the cleansing foam. So I'm super excited to see how it all comes together. The best thing about Anua's cleansing oil is that it is watery. It gently removes sebum and prevents clogged pore problems like whiteheads, blackheads, congested pores, and texture, which come from closed chromodones. The cleansing oil is watery and easy to rub without stimulus, penetrating into the pores deeper. It is safe to use for acne prone, sensitive skin. The cleansing oil gently and perfectly removes waterproof base and eye makeup with no eye irritation. So that was my oil cleanser done. Now I'm gonna go in with the cleansing foam. To go hand in hand with the cleansing oil is the cleansing foam, where the bubble is so small, which allows it to clean the pore. cleansing foam has a little bit of an exfoliator which prevents excessive dead skin cells. It's a mild exfoliator that doesn't strip the skin. Its soft bubble penetrates deep into the pores and cleans sebum and dead cells. If you're wondering why you're suddenly getting whiteheads and blackheads, that could be from clogged pores. Clogged pores occurs when sebum from the skin cannot be discharged smoothly and clumps up and clogs the pores. If the sebum get covered up by dead skin cells, it develops into acne, whiteheads and closed comedones. <laughs> This is like the most fanciest package I've gotten. I'm so grateful. Ah! I have one for daily skincare routine and that features their heart leaf toner, which I have been using every single night. And this peach serum. And I've seen this everywhere on TikTok and I can't wait to try it out myself. Then on this side, we have our special skincare. So it's got a BHA gentle exfoliating toner. And then this niacinamide and TXA serum. Hey guys, so I'm out of the shower now. My face is all cleansed and I'm gonna go in with the rest of my skincare. So I'm gonna go in with the heart leaf toner. I always use this every single night and I feel like it really helps my skin issues, fades my acne. I also have the toner pads but I save them for when I have really bad breakouts because I kid you guys not, when I use one it literally helps, extinguishes the pimple overnight so I treat that one like gold and I like use it very carefully. I use two toners, I don't know why, I feel like the rice one just helps like add a bit of glow. Side note, from all the skincare, has anyone watched the new Hunger Games? The prequel? Oh my god, you guys. I literally just watched that on the weekend with my friend and it's so good. I'm like literally obsessed. 
and I'm like, for all my friends who haven't seen it, if you guys want to go watch it, please ask me because I would love to go multiple times because Young Snow is my favorite. An evil character shouldn't be able to look that good. My whole TikTok for you page is literally him and I'm not complaining. Snow lands on top. If you've seen the ballad of songbirds and snakes, let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. I'm gonna go in with a serum from this suitcase. I'm gonna try this peach serum. It looks so pretty and it's pink so I'm already in love. This one is a lightweight everyday serum that delivers glass skin. It looks very like watery. glides on so nice oh wow this is really nice it's not sticky at all also i forgot to mention because i got sidetracked the cleanser when i double cleanse it felt so good my skin felt so nice and like it could breathe again and it didn't feel like it stripped my skin so you know how you get that feeling where it's like super tight when you move your facial muscles that double cleansing technique didn't make me feel like that so i'm really happy also it didn't sting my eyes and here's a little tip from me to you because i just learned this today but the cleansing foam a little goes a long way i don't use too much am i glowing I'm only halfway through my skincare. Now for eye cream. I've been getting into eye creams lately. Anyways, back to the ballad of Songbird and Snakes. I haven't read the book yet, but I read the Hunger Games trilogy. I was obsessed with that in high school. I got the books and everything, and my books were the matte black one. Because you know how you have like two, I think there were two different forms of books, and I still have it, and I kept it in absolute pristine condition. So what I'm thinking is I really want to get the ballad of Songbirds and Snakes book so I can read it because apparently like I'm missing so much. Yeah, I really want to get that so I can read it. And then I really want to read all the Hunger Games books again and then watch the movies in chronological order because I do have some pimples. I'm going to go in with some pimple cream. But guys, I'm so obsessed with the movie. Young Snow is so fine. So let me know your thoughts down in the comments below because that is like my hot topic right now. I'm gonna go in with the Anua moisturizer. And their tip is to use a moisturizer that doesn't block the pores. So like to not undo all the hard work that we just did with double cleansing, you gotta use a proper moisturizer that helps sustain the proper sebum levels to prevent excess sebum secretion. I love this moisturizer. Also it comes with this little spatula and personally I haven't really used this spatula until I got these nails. You girls know the problem with when you get long nails, you cannot use like your fingers the way you'd normally do. So I absolutely love the fact that it comes with this little spatula and then I feel so fancy. Look at that! Like it saves it from getting under your nails. This is my entire skincare done. I love it. I feel like it's giving me such a nice glow and that I really do have glass skin. Yeah, like, I think I'm nice and glowy and shiny. I look like a glazed donut, but without the oil. And also using this, it didn't sting my skin. I don't think I have like super sensitive skin. I think I have just like normal skin that suffers from acne breakouts and also lately my face has been a bit dry because I have been suffering from hay fever. It feels really nice and nourished now. I don't feel dry at all. Big shout out to Anua. Thank you guys so much for sending me all this stuff because I genuinely use it every single day and every single night. It is that good and it's helped me with my skincare so much. So I'm so so grateful. Anyways, this is my skincare routine. I really hope you guys found this video helpful and that you guys enjoyed watching. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Don't forget to give this video a big a thumbs up subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video for vlogmas Wah! bye isn't there anyone who knows what christmas is all about